Proposed legislation known as the Americans or America's Children Act has been introduced to Congress. It's an effort to protect documented dreamers from deportation. Those are people who were brought into the United States legally as children, but they lose that protection when they turn 21. WCNC Charlotte's Tradisha Woodward, uh, Woodard has more details. 18-year-old Joshua Gregerson says his life feels like a ticking time bomb. Instead of being happy about turning 21, pretty sad about it. He says in less than 30 days, his big sister will have to self-deport. I don't know when I'm going to see her again. And the closer he inches to 21, the more he thinks about leaving behind everything he's ever known. I don't know what I'm going to do if that happens. Gregerson's situation and thousands of others like it prompted lawmakers like North Carolina Congresswoman Deborah Ross to sponsor the America's Children's Act. It would change immigration law so that documented dreamers wouldn't age out of the system and lose their protection. We have 21 year olds who have lived in this country sometimes for almost 21 years who then have to self deport and separate themselves from their families. They speak our language. They want to stay in our country. Why would we make this many investments in them and their education and then send them to our competitors. Data shows there are more than 250,000 documented dreamers in the U.S. right now, with many of them pursuing careers in STEM, science, technology, engineering, and math. 90% of documented dreamers are uh, are in the STEM fields. It would add $30 billion um, in net fiscal benefit. This act truly is a narrow, bipartisan, bicameral, common sense fix. They say this is an opportunity to retain more highly skilled workers and keep families together. Tradisha Woodard, WCNC Charlotte.